Where are you at? Or we're here. Where are you guys? Right in front of your house. Oh, I'm almost there. Almost there. You said 8.30, it, Rudy. You better be here in a minute. Oh, it's too late. It's 8.30, whore. You said 8.29. No, you didn't. No, it's 8.29 already. No, it's 8.30. Your, your clock is just off. Yeah. <laughs> no, you guys are clock are off. All my clocks in my car and Juan's clock and my clock are on time. So, obviously... Well, all, all of us are wrong, then. How about that? You ever thought of that, Axel? How about you, you, you get your ass over here and I kiss you? <laughs> you know, on my car, it's it's off by a minute. <laughs> there we go, Axel. About ours is right, yours is wrong. About that. No, that's my car. This is Axel's car. Yeah. That's Volkswagen. Uh, uh, yeah, We're that, always on time. Volkswagen's always on time. Yeah, to break down. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you. <laughs> time? And then, um, one time. She was like, she was like, why is it that every time when I want to do something, when I want to stay out late with you, you're like, you're like, um, um, you're like, you, you always hesitate. Welcome back to the channel. Oh, I'm fucking exhausted, man. Carrying all these boxes and stuff. But it's a fun one today. So, I can finally reveal what I've been wanting to reveal to you guys. And that's... And there's one more in the trunk. I have way too much stuff in the trunk that only one box would, would fit. And I feel like two would fit, but there wasn't enough space. So two in the passenger seat, or in the back seat, and one in the passenger. Ooh, it was a workout, man. So we're about to go get them installed. Um, I called the people yesterday, asked around. Um, hopefully they price match Amazon, because it's like 10 bucks cheaper on Amazon per tire, and they'll save me like 40 bucks. And I'm not trying to be cheap, but honestly, I'm broke. This whole pandemic really effed me up, so I know I shouldn't even be getting wheels, but whatever. I'll reveal to you guys what wheels I got, but I'll just tell you the brand right now and they're Option Labs. So, yeah. We got a good old cup of OJ. Oh, that hits the spot. If you're one of those people that doesn't like orange juice, I don't know what to tell you. You need that vitamin C. But I'm gonna let my car warm up and then we're gonna head there. It's about, I don't know, seven, 10 minute drive. So I'll update you guys once I get there. Okay guys, so I just pulled up to the I was about to say gas station. It's because there's literally a gas station right behind me. But I know I came to Big O Tires. It's one of those like franchise or corporate ones. I feel like it might be a ripoff because they're charging. Uh, I'll tell you guys how much they're charging and everything um, per tire and mounting and all that. But let me just go in there and talk to them. All right, guys. So hopefully you guys can hear me kind of how the window cracked a bit just because for some weird reason today it was raining even last night it was raining in San Jose and it's just super humid right now and I hate humidity uh, but what's it called so the last time you saw okay so um so it's been like it's already 140 so it's been like maybe like four or five hours now uh, and last time you guys saw was me at Big O Tires. I went there. It wasn't a dealio. It wasn't. It, worked, it didn't work out for me. Um, the manager there was a little bit rude to me, and I was like, okay, whatever. Um, I just asked if they price matched Amazon. He said it. He said, he said no, but he said it in like really rude tone. That I was like, all right, whatever. I'm just gonna walk out. And then I went down the street to a more like local San Jose um, tire business. It's called Calderon Tires.
tires. I've been there a couple times before when I had like nails on my, uh, on my, I was about to say shoes, uh, nails on my um, tires on my other cars. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go check them out. And I went there, I asked if they had Federals, uh, the 595 SSS, uh, they didn't carry those. But they did have the Toyos and I was like, okay, how much is it gonna be? I was like, okay, how much is it gonna be for uh, for Toyos? And then he ended up telling me the price. It was a little bit more than the Amazon price, which kind of was a bummer, but I thought about it. I'm like, well, I'm gonna get, a I'm gonna get them all done today. So it's like, you know, might as well just pay a little bit extra and then like, I'll get it done. Oh man, the camera's really shaking. Um, so yeah, right now I'm on my way to go pick him up. So my camera's shaking right now, locked into the road. So I'll just update you guys once I get there. I don't know about you guys, but just got the wheels. And four wheels do fit in this BRZ. Kind of tight, but they fit. And I'm still able to shift decent. But I got two wheels right here. I feel like a third one would, would fit in the back right here if I just kind of did a little bit better. And then I do have hella stuff in my trunk. Uh, let me pop it. Let me just pop it. I do have like this, this coolant, um, some extra oil, you know, just little safety equipment in case I need it. But I had like some other trash and stuff. I had, I literally bought these. Uh, went to the wipers and I've never used them. Brand new. I gotta install them. But yeah, one of them was able to fit. I feel like there was gonna be enough room for maybe another one if I put the seats down. But yeah. So this is how it currently looks. I'm really bummed because I don't know if it was this one, this wheel, one of these wheels. It's like super. Dirty like I don't know I was gonna pick it up, but uh, Come on focused It's really hard to focus with the white, but this part's super dirty. I don't know if they scratched it. It might just be dirt Yeah, I think it might just be dirt, but Yeah, they look really nice And they put some counterweights and yeah, they balanced them. They balanced them and everything. So I'll show you guys the price um, once I get home. I came to O'Reilly just to meet up with Rodolfo so I could show him the wheels since it's right next to his work. And then he actually called me telling me um, that it was a good thing I didn't go to Big O. So I'll tell you guys why. Um, well, so he told me, he called me right now, which was kind of ironic. Like literally once I turned on my car and was like pulling out, he called me saying like, it was a good reason. It was a good thing I didn't go to Big O because they were going to mark it up hella crazy for installing it if I went there. So luckily, Rodolfo hooked it up with some gloves, so I was able to buy a pack of 100. And... Um, I'm probably not going to be able to install them today. Um, I do have work in an hour and I got to get ready. So I'm just going to unload them into my room and then... Tomorrow before work, I'm um, going to install them. So for you guys, it's gonna be probably like just two seconds. For me, it's gonna be a whole like 20, 20. It's gonna be like a whole 18 hours that's gonna go by. So I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Just got off work right now. Um, I wasn't going to put the wheels on today, but Axel was supposed to meet me here, but I guess he ran into something, so he's gonna meet me at my house. So I'm gonna head home right now. As you can see, the wheels aren't in the back. I only have one in the trunk, and the three, the three um, are in my house. So I'm gonna go meet him at my house. I gotta borrow my brother Jack. I gotta ask him if I can borrow it, and then I think I already have the lug nuts here. Oh yeah, I do. Uh, I got, uh, I don't know, one of them came loose. Cool, and then I got the lug nuts right here. Boom. Cool, 
So I just need the three wheels, and then we're gonna meet up with Dolph. We're gonna meet up with Rodolfo at O'Reilly's. All right, so we just got here. It's Rodolfo's car right there. Look at his new wheels. Clean. I think they're supposed to be like GT500 style wheels, and he has a little bit similar but different those. The ones in the front. Those actually used to be on my Mustang. This one has more of like a star pattern in the middle than this one right here. But it looks pretty clean. And then here's my car, stock wheels right now. But that's gonna change right now. I got it right there in the Axel's car. This is Axel's car right here. Looking hella sexy. Aftermarket headlights. It's downhill, so we should be good. Um, well, just let me know once it's like up uh, out of the tires. Yeah, so right now we're oh, well, we're crazy. installing the new wheels and tires for Juan's 2017 Jersey, right? 2021. 2021. 2021. 2021. 2030. 2030, yeah, yeah. We're going to speak about the 2020s. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys look to your left, this is a Mark 10. <laughs> it's a Mark 10 GTI. Damn. I got the hookups from Germany. Yeah, shout out to Volkswagen. <laughs> shout out to Just trying to focus on your face, the camera, but <laughs> you guys done. asked me if you wanted me to swap over the two PMS sensors from this one to the aftermarket and I was like nah nah <laughs> I was like fuck it yeah, let me just run with that without them so you won't be able to know if they're low or not right yeah I won't shit I want to be you know real JDM real JDM my my car is just through the uh the ABS oh really yeah damn so like it's not it doesn't give I think it doesn't give the accurate rating but yeah I mean that's better than fucking TPMS sensors yeah Let's compare. Willies. Oh, oh, that's really thinny boy. Thicky boy. Dude, look at that. Like, watch my hand yeah. right here. It doesn't go. Yeah, it doesn't. Let's help this shit fit. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? We probably should have tried it with my car before you go to just in case. You know what I mean? Well, no, this this one's um, five by one hundred. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So I tried it with my brother's. It's two forty, but it's. It, it, it didn't line up. Didn't line up. Yeah, oh, because he, he has like I think the same size or maybe a little bigger. Mm -hmm. uh, well, at least you can say you're no longer a Prius wheel boy. <laughs> I didn't know you knew about that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Quan, I wanted this car. <laughs> <laughs> I barely found out about that shit. What's up, Jesse? <laughs> I didn't know you knew about yeah. that. <laughs> I barely found out about that shit. Like literally, like maybe like three days ago. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I used to hear like the references and everything, yeah. but then I was like, I'm like, Prius. Prius. I don't get it. I believe in you, Juan. You got this. <laughs> it's the wrong side. <laughs> Is it? No. Nah. <laughs> I wonder if these would work, bro. Oh, wow, they would. Wasting $140 for <laughs> <laughs> It's nice. Yeah. I, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know if I'm doing a good job at this cameraman thing. It's cool, man. I mean, you only spent four years in college for it. <laughs> <laughs> you imagine that shit? Dude, I'd cry. Just pulled up to the post office and I just want to give a big shout out to Lily for ordering four stickers. I included another one for free and I give you a little bit extra since it was your birthday. Hopefully you like um Alright what's up guys? So it's actually the next day and I got the wheels installed at Riley's. I didn't record it. There are some 
homeless dude. I don't know if he was homeless, but he was super rude to me. So, they just skipped that. So, I just skipped it to the next day. So, this is how it looks like. Came to one of my favorite roads in San Jose. I don't want to talk. I'm not going to mention the road just because I don't want more cars out here. But this is how it looks like. So remember, 18 by 9.5, 35 offset. Um, it's pretty meaty. I haven't gotten an alignment, so that's how it looks like right now. Yeah, to me it looks a little bit odd. So the, re oh, the reason I am pulled over right now is because my TPMS sensor light came on. And when I had the wheels on yesterday, everything was good, but now they came on, so... I feel like now the reg the car's registering saying that, you know, the light's on. That, because I didn't put TPMS sensors on here. But that's like how it looks like. And then that's the top part. And then this is like the side part right here. So not too bad. And then let me show you guys the back part. I love the back part. It looks super aggressive. And it's pretty flush. The front part looks a little bit more um, like poke, but maybe just like negative two degrees of camber. I don't want to run camber, but I feel like negative two won't be that much. I'm really not trying to be like, you know, one of those guys. So hopefully I didn't get a flat tire because there's some road work going on and these roads aren't the best. Sometimes there's nails and stuff. Alright, let's see if the TPMS sensor light comes back on. It's that one right there. And it's flashing. So I'm gonna drive, let's see how it goes. <laughs> 